So another test that you can do is the gelatin test. Gelatin determines whether or not a bacteria has the enzyme gelatinase. Gelatin is commonly found in jello, but it's actually a protein, even though we use it as a thickener. So the gelatin test is a solid test. You inoculate it as you would a sim test. So after 24 hours incubation, you could see something that looks like this. So notice my control tube is on the right and my test tube on the left. So notice now how the gelatin has become liquefied. However, I'm not finished with this test yet. I need to check the reaction and confirm liquefaction. In order to do that, I would place this test in an ice bath for at least 30 minutes. At the end of 30 minutes, I would compare my tube to the control tube, the positive control tube. Now, when I lift it out, notice the test tube has solidified once again and the positive control tube remains liquefied. If you have a positive gelatin result, your tube will not re-solidify. It will remain liquid.